Good morning, HST, Biata, and Dan. My name is Steven Cito, and I'm talking to you from Bradenton, Florida. This week, I received great news. I finally qualified to become a partner at HST. There's so many people to thank. Um, I'd like to start with all the customers that trusted me with their well being, including their families, too. And then there's Joe and the fantastic team at HST. I want to thank him and thank them and thank them again. And then of course, there's Todd Myers, who's built a powerhouse region full of support and with great leaders on the team. And then lastly is Mark Burns, who not only is my upline, but I consider him a great friend also. Mark has spent so much time training me and helping me with my marketing and sales plan that really this honor goes as much to him as it does to me. So thank all of you. Mark and Todd recruited me, I think it was the second quarter of 2018. And around that time, I made a few sales and I got my first look at the May 2018 Millionaire Report. And I said, oh my God, I will never become a partner. But here I am today. And I think one of the things that I remember about that early period was I got up one morning, uh, commuted to work less than one minute. And before I finished my morning coffee, I made $1,100 already. I'm not sure if that constitutes an epiphany, but I sure got motivated after that. Now, the one thing that I would advise is that, and I'll probably get some leaders mad at me, I personally don't like to make 500 calls a day and have people call me vulgar names. So what I do is I, I just spend a lot of time leveraging my relationships. Uh, my plumber, my handyman, my housekeeper, uh, when I sit down at the restaurant and talk to waiters and the GM, I always ask them about their health insurance. And little by little, you'll get you know great, great referrals. I, I, I remember getting one, a family that I've insured for three years. They referred me to two customers in Atlanta who referred me to another two customers. And they also refer me to mom and a sister in Ohio, and they refer me to four farmers in Ohio. So you get, you just get opportunities like that that come if you keep at it. So it's been that type of a journey for me. The one way that I make my journey more enjoyable is I study, learn, and study and learn some more on carrier webinars. I always call Dennis, I always call Sherry with help, and of course, mark my upline as well. So how does it make it more enjoyable? Well, the better I know my products and carriers, the easier my presentation will be, and all the money I make is sure enjoyable. And by the way, don't avoid the bad calls either. There's many times that I've advocated for my customer. I've, with their permission, I've called their doctor's office, urgent care, and in a couple of cases, I call the hospitals and Meriton as well to make sure that they understand what's happened to their policies. And all this support you give them, believe it or not, will make your journey enjoyable. There's only one thing I can think of to do with my $10,000 check, and that's to give it to Rose, my wife of 42 years. She's been with me through all the highs, all the lows, and she is as responsible for my partnership as anyone. So she's getting the money, but hopefully she'll decide to go to Vegas. <laughs>